Neil Shane here, host of the Extreme Full Efficient channel. Welcome to another episode of bonus footage with EPF. I'm actually very, very happy to share this video with you guys today. No lies. This video is very chilled, you know. It is just a collection of my most recent fishing adventures down the Jersey Shore with my friends. But you know what? The exciting thing about it is that in this video, you guys will actually get to see two new species that I have caught just recently for my species list. Number 204 and 205. Now, please understand that since this is a bonus footage video, right, the footage is mostly action. Knowledge information wise, it is going to be a little bit lackluster, okay? It's starting from the next video onwards, salt water wise, I am going to include more information, right? How exactly I'm finding this fish, how I'm catching them, what I am throwing, etc. This video, like I said, is more like a chilled video, just action, all right? Another thing you guys need to take in consideration before you watch the footage for this video is safe fish handling skills. I have seen a bunch of people on the YouTube platform complain recently that the fish handling skills and the saltwater videos haven't been very good, right? Well, <laughs> I would like to emphasize that most of the saltwater species that we have been catching recently on the videos, we have actually been taking them back home to eat. So, you know, I mean, we, we've been killing those fish, right, for human consumption. So, of course, when you're going to kill a fish, you don't, you don't really need to worry so much about safe fish handling skills unless you are going to practice some good old catch photo release right i just wanted to tell you guys these two things before you guys get into this footage hopefully you will enjoy it i was very very excited to catch those new species of fish it is quite an accomplishment and let's not forget right before the end of the year i do want to have at least 250 species under my name all right we are currently at 205 all right grab your popcorn enjoy I'll see you guys. Man, I got like very small bites. I'm snagged. Oh, I'm out, I'm out, I'm out. Something's on. What is this? It's a burgal. Oh, oh no. So maybe the sucking master yeah, sucky is a burgal. Well, I'm gonna use this as cut bait. This burgal is officially cut bait now. Got a bite all out there. It's on. I don't know. I'm using fish strip. Oh, yeah. 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 Oh, Swing it all the way, blue fish for dinner oh my. on the fish strip. Whoa, let me get some of this. <laughs> Bergal, man, Bergal saving the day. What the? Oh my goodness gracious. I thought maybe catch a little sea robin, you know? Wow. Not bad, not bad. Oh, I got snagged? Oh no, I got a hit. I got a hit when I was really in, dude. Not bad. The thing with this cocktail blues is that their teeth is really brutal. They really can take your hook just like that. So I just let them take it and I retie it, it's no big deal. Perfect eating size, not a lot of mercury, not a lot of PCBs, cocktail blues all day. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Ooh, when the bluefish is around, nice one, right? Nice. <laughs> Your dad's gonna be happy now. Uh, I gotta use my good casking knife right over here. Look at that, huh? We're using <laughs> we're using bluefish for bluefish. This thing cuts through the meat and everything. 
like it's nothing. Just put a whole strip like this on the hook. You never know what you're going to catch. I'm gonna show you guys here real quick. Look at that, huh? Boom, just like that. One, two. Woo! Dave, oh, missed it. He's on? Yeah, Dave got one on here. See? I can chop this piece off because it's too big. Nice! Yeah, cocktail blues, whole day. Fight really good. Good eating. Cast it out there, let it hit bottom. Oh, oh, got a hit, got a hit. Ooh, had a hit right there already. Didn't take, oh, it's on. Oh, it's off, it's off, it's off. Got two hits since it was down there. Oh, it's on, now it's on. Oh boy, man, got two hits, came back on for a third time. They are feeding aggressive, man. They are feeding aggressive. Bluefish on bluefish. Bluefish on a cart right now. Yeah, bro. <laughs> bro, this is insane. Insane, man. That is crazy. Gotta be very careful with these teeth. Oh, they've got one. Oh, like I said, very careful. Double up on the bluefish here. All right, got him hooked by itself. Oh, beautiful, dude. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Good dinner. Just be very careful not to mess up with these teeth. This teeth is definitely no joke. You see that? Don't want to mess with that. Otherwise, my sub's going to be offended. Offended. Whoa. Oh, my goodness. This is the best day of bluefish I've had in a while. This one got off, but it's okay. So many of them out there right now. Whoa. Look at that. Bait flipping out of the water. Insane. Definitely insane. Super strike. Yeah. Oh my goodness. As soon as he went in, man. Wow. Whole school of bluefish. Just right here. Cocktail blues. Wow. This is this is impressive. Oh my god. Did you see that jump? Oh. Everywhere. Oh, oh bro. Double up! Oh. Action is definitely hot. Stellar. Stellar, stellar, man. Day like this, hard to find. Stellar, bro. Oh, there we go. Got him. Got him, got him, got him. I got a horse sitting in it. My first one ever. Bro. Yeah. First one ever. Oh yeah. Let's get out of here so I can land it safely on ground. Bro, hell yeah. Whew. Finally. Oh my goodness. Took a while. My first one ever. Wait, what is this? Yes, that's it. That's it. Oh, took so long, man. I'm so happy about it, bro. <laughs> I am so stoked. Oh man, took so long for me to catch this damn fish. 
I don't need to catch another one for the rest of the day. That's it. I only needed one. Got it. Everything's good, man. Bro, I don't need to catch another one for years now, man. I only needed one for my list, bro. Wow. Yeah, dude. Came in close. Finally. And, and it was one cast. That's okay. it, you know. Did they you just came it? in close. Yeah. You see got bait on my eyes now. Yeah, dude. Silver sides. Dude, got a silver side right here. Look at, whoa, dude, look. This is what they're eating out there. That's crazy, bro. Wow, I'm so happy, man. Came over there, come reach me. Bro, one cast. That's all I needed, you know, man. It came in close enough, gave one cast, it took it. Thank you so much for this poem, bro. Oh, yeah, the, I mean, that was, the spoon. Yeah, yeah, this poem, man. Oh, one and a half, you know. I, I couldn't cast that far, you know what I'm saying, bro? Yeah. Wow, so there you guys have it, huh? The species number... 204 the Atlantic Bonito took a while to catch this guy finally came up it's gonna be dinner now species number 204 oh my goodness dude you see that oh my goodness bro Right there, right there, to the right. Oh, another pot, another pot. Dang it, man. I think it's a bluefish. Oh, wait. Oh, no. It's a bonito. Nice, bro. Bonito, huh? Yeah. Nice. Very nice. All right. John is right. There's a bunch of banded runner fish. Yeah, I'm trying to catch one, man. I don't have one yet. Bro! <laughs> They're eating the minnows. Wanna put a piece on? Yeah, hell yeah. So pass me the hook. We'll just, yeah, it's on Thank that you, man. wire, so it's not too oh. nasty. Here, bro. The pliers. So you just put the salmon skin on the hook? That's pretty much it? When I was, didn't notice. Oh, look at that, look at that, they're going for it. Oh, look at it. <laughs> oh, bro, no kidding. Oh, no, oh, no. This dude is a genius. Oh. Little salmon skin on the spoon. The rudder fish will go for it. What the hell? Never heard about this before. Was that the rudder fish? <laughs> oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh, oh, oh son! They really, they really got it, bro! I got this, bro! I got this! I got this, man! I got this, bro! Woohoo! I got it, bro! Unbelievable! It works! It works, man! My first ever banded rudderfish, man! Thanks to uh, a no Asian gentleman over there. Yeah, dude, this is what I'm talking about. Oh, dude! My first ever banded rudderfish! Unbelievable! Oh man, if it wasn't for that gentleman to tell me to put a little piece of salmon skin at the end of the hook, I'm not so sure I would be able to have caught this guy. It's a little beauty right here. 
Ah, so what did you guys think, huh? Not bad, not bad, huh? So many things have been happening in my fishing life recently, as you guys can see, right? My saltwater adventures recently in New Jersey, I caught three new species, as a matter of fact. The two that you guys saw in this video, the banded rudderfish, Seriola zonata, and the Atlantic bonito, the sarda sarda. And on top of that, in one of the previous videos, I caught a striped sea robin, right? The Prionotus evolans, if I am not wrong, okay? It took me a little, I got a little brain fart on the scientific name of that fish. But yeah, a lot of cool things have been going on in the Jersey Shore, and the multi-species is going to continue. The life listing is going to continue. There's still a lot of species from over here that I don't have yet, right? So I'm going, I'm going to continue to chase them. But things have been quite good, catching new species, taking some fish home to eat, you know, those cocktail bluefish, the Pomatomus saltatrix, right? perfect size for human consumption, not a lot of PCBs, not a lot of heavy metals, not to mention that the meat is tender and not too oily. Got to try my first ever striped sea robin, even though you guys don't really get to see these things on YouTube, right? I post most of the catch and cooks on my Instagram via Instagram stories, right? I posted the striped sea robin, I posted the Atlantic bonito sashimi, we made rolls out of the Atlantic bonito and ate it, right? Sushi rolls, we ate sashimi style. So, you know, things have been going good. I hope you guys enjoyed this short episode. I'll be back with more videos on the channel soon. Tie lines, I'll see you all next time. The birds are going crazy right now. And the thing about this type of fishing is that it is very sporadic. You never know when, gonna, when they're gonna blitz, you never know when they're gonna feed. So you always gotta have your bail open and just wait. Until it is within your casting range, you just cast right into there and you nail them. It is not the easiest thing to do.